So this is a tray that I've been uh, a little uh, late in getting around to showing, but I have had it set aside uh, for, what, a good week or, or two now? Um, actually, by the time this video comes up, it'll probably be three, maybe four, um, because I'm uh, planning right now on getting a lot of uh, trade and sale binders uploaded, and then all these uh, TCBM videos that I'm making, I've uh, probably made a week or two before you're actually seeing them. So anyways, now that I've gone through that, um, definitely showing off stuff from uh, this entire video is all about Pokemon Collection 1, aka Steven Fisher, and I'm just going to put his Houndoom, oh it didn't want to stay up, um, his Houndoom picture back here in the background. So we'll kind of perk that up, Houndoom's, oh actually I'm going to bring that down so you can actually see Houndoom. Um, Houndoom's one of my favorite Pokemon, so this is a pretty cool drawing to get in. And we have a note that says, Hey Cat, it's been a very long time since the last time we traded. I hope I helped out your legendary treasure set, as I am only missing a few cards myself. Send along some cool extras, send a drawing of one of my favorite Pokemon. It's kind of interesting, I took an art class for my degree, and I was failing the class because my drawing skills were horrible, stick figures. Somehow I was able to go from an F to an A in the art class because I found out I could draw almost anything I could look at. If the idea was from my head, it sucked. I rarely send drawings to people, but you're one exception. Sorry for the rambling enjoy the cards Pokemon collection one not sure why I gave the face a hat but it looked weird so uh, Pokemon collection one has actually been a friend of mine for years I think back since before the cat's meowth was ever around when it was just computer 3 and CSU um, he's I think mostly well known for his um, his huge raffles that he does he's also got like a complete season and movie collection of all the Pokemon stuff um, which is pretty impressive, and um, he does a lot of video game stuff as well, and has uh, put up like tutorials and stuff on his website, um, or not website, on his channel that have really helped out a lot of people. Um, but he's also a collector, uh, he's uh, been talking lately about maybe, you know, dropping out of, uh, of collecting cards, which I really hope he doesn't, hope he just kind of cuts back. Um, because uh, he, he's, he's a great collector out there, and uh, he's been through a lot of stuff, especially with YouTube, uh, losing channels and stuff like that. But he's a really cool guy. And uh, now let's go ahead and get on to the cards. So, um, these are some reverses that we traded for to help out my collection. Kragunk, Swadloon, and Swablu. Uh, my reverses once list are slowly getting a little better. And then he was also able to finish off a lot of my regular set. So we've got a uh, hollow Rayquaza, pretty much all the stuff that I didn't pull from a box. Hollow Superior, hollow Charizard, and a Mewtwo EX. So the only cards I'm missing from the regular Legendary Treasure set are uh, the Golden cards, Reshiram and Zekrom, and then I'm still needing you know a bunch of uh, reverses. So that was a huge help, and it looks like he also sent some extras. Um, bunch of extras. Old school extras, it looks like. We've got Kragonk, Wismer, Raticate, Lopunny, and Battle Tower. Ah, uh, good old VS Seeker, remember that card. Kragonk, Pachirisu, Numel, uh, Bibberil, Champion's Room, Pikachu, Magikarp, Ninkata, Buizel, Baltoy, Roselia, Growlithe, Mudkip, Night Teleporter, Gibble, Bulbasaur, Starly, Chingling, VS Seeker, and a Drift Bloom. Doduo, Sandshrew, Mudkip, oh, I forgot that Mudkip. Gibble, Baldo Baltoy, Spiritum C, Hippopotas, Murkrow, and Metadite. Cricketot, Chadot G, Yanma. Pachirisu, and Geodude. So, old school stuff. Uh, looked like mostly, let's see, Supreme Victors. I think it was, was it all Supreme Victors? Yeah, all Supreme Victor stuff. Um, did you just open a Supreme Victors box recently? Because they all feel pretty minty, too. So, again, Pokemon Collection 1, thank you very much for the trade. Um, hopefully you'll be staying and collecting a little bit, so I uh, can hopefully trade with you again.